We're looking at a sector of a whole circle, which means it's a fraction of a whole circle. So this part here, all of this, the orange and the yellow, all of that, that's what we're looking for, the area. Now, we have an angle. It is a fraction of the whole revolution, or 360 degrees of the whole birthday cake, if you like. It is 28 degrees. That's the fraction of it. So how do you find the area of a fraction of a whole circle? Well, there is a formula, and the formula is as follows. Now, first of all, the first part of the formula is the fractional part of it. And that angle there, we'll call it theta. And the total of the whole circle, the whole disk, the whole birthday cake, is 360 degrees, of course, times the area of a conventional full circle, which is pi r squared. That is the area of a fraction of a circle. That's the formula. So all we need to do is plonk these numbers into there and come up with the correct answer. So let's do that now. So area of the whole shaded region is theta, which is the angle component. The angle component we have is 28 degrees, all over the full component, which is 360, times pi, times, now the radius is given here as 10.5 meters, so it's pretty big. Now, what we need to do with the 10.5 is to what? We need to square it, yeah? So let's square it, so it's squared. So 28 over 360, 28 of the whole thing, which is 360, times pi times 10.5, all squared, take note of that squared. Let's work that out, putting that into our calculator, we will get here 28 divided by 360 is 0.078 times pi times 10.5 all squared. 10.5 is 110.25. And that, putting the whole thing in the calculator in one hit, is 26.94 meters squared. Take a minute to check out our website at http colon forward slash forward slash www.vividmaths.com. You'll find additional resources, cheat sheets, transcripts, and other maths videos that are not available on YouTube. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to get access to all the written answers for your maths questions plus other special offers.